On its northern frontier, Russia is flexing its muscle. This is the Arctic Brigade. In training, in case there's confrontation with Russia's neighbors. For in the Arctic now, there is a battle for supremacy that Russia is determined to win. This base, close to Finland, is normally off-limits to Western media, but we've been invited to meet Russia's Arctic army. It is the ultimate Cold War. Temperatures here can fall to minus 40 centigrade. Today, the brigade is on exercises, repelling an enemy attack. Recently, Washington accused Moscow of acting aggressively in the Arctic to increase its military presence. Russia's response, what's the problem? I think any country, no matter where it is, has its own interests and protects its territory. This is our land, Russian land, and we will defend it. This is the first time that foreign journalists have been allowed to film this brigade. And by bringing us here, the Russian military is sending a clear message to the outside world that Russia is ready and determined to protect its national interests in the Arctic. That's because there is money to be made here. The Arctic waters are thought to contain one quarter of the planet's undiscovered oil and gas. With polar ice shrinking, there's now an opportunity to extract the energy. There are new shipping lanes too. Russia is competing with other Arctic powers for a slice of the profits. It's also building a string of Arctic bases. President Putin visited one last month. Russia's attempt to back up its economic claims with a show of strength. But it's a fashion show we're treated to back on base. To survive the Arctic, you need the right clothes and the right food. For the Arctic Brigade, that means Russian sausages and fresh fish. Then it's back on patrol. Russia says it doesn't seek conflict in the Arctic. But there are competing interests in this region, and Russia is in no mood to back down. Steve Rosenberg, BBC News at the Alakorti base in the Russian Arctic.